Hello, welcome to Cashflow. Today we're going to show you how to create customers and how to create suppliers. Firstly, to create a customer on the left hand side, if you just click into the customer module, you'll see on the top right hand side we have a little button to create to add in a new customer. If we click on here, it's just a case of adding the customer name. As you can see, it's automatically created a customer code for me, but I could change that if I wanted to. We have an option to say where this customer came from, so we can track that in our reporting. And I can also enter their full details I wish to from here. If I just click on the Create Customer button here, it's now going to create this customer for me. Once we've created our customer record, we can then go and add more information in so we can store their address, their postcode, all their contact details, name, telephone number, email and a website. All this information can be stored against the customer record. We will have the option to add in notes, so you can free type any notes that you want to store against the customer as well. If we click on the options menu, we can put in a default purchase order number. Uh, we could change the source of where the, business, the client came in from and we can change their payment terms as well. We can store their VAT details, their default sales codes and we can just choose their default invoice and quote templates as well and any discount we're assigning against the customer. We also have the ability to set up custom fields against customer records so I've set up to record a client's birthdays and also whether or not they're priority customers as well. If we click into the invoices and stats screen, we'll be able to see a full list of invoices that have been set aside against this customer and also any quotes that may be outstanding. We can see the statistics on the right hand side as well, so we can see when the client was last invoiced and also things like their average time to pay. We also have the ability to see any recurring invoices like subscriptions that are linked to this client and we can add advanced payments against accounts. On the right hand side, we can see our forms and envelopes as well. Once a customer is created, we can go to our customer screen and be able to see a full list of customers including their value and outstanding balance of the business. To create a supplier, all we need to do is click on the supplier module on the left hand side and we follow a very similar process. So if we just go to create a supplier record, all we need to do is type the name of the supplier. As you can see, it's already created the supplier code for me as well. And then I just click Create a Supplier button. As you can see, it will take us through to the supplier record. Very similar to the customer record, we can put in the supplier's address, their contact details, <coughs> email address, website, etc., and any notes. Other information, we can store their bank account information if we were paying our supplier via via backs. And we can put in our default payment method, our payment terms of working with our supplier, the VAT details and default purchase codes and default layouts as well. We can see a full list of purchases and we can see our statistics for our supplier as well. And we can make any advanced payments on account from here. And then we have our stationary defaults that we can select from here as well. Once we go into a supplier screen, we'll be able to see all our suppliers listed the same way we list our customers and we can see the total we've paid them and any other outstanding balance we have with our suppliers. And that's how easy it is to create customers and suppliers within Cashflow.